The two features I want to cover here are the Smart Lookup and Thesaurus. A thesaurus is used to look up synonyms, or another word that's synonymous with the word that you're looking up. In other words, you want to say the same thing, but by using a different word, because you may lose the comprehension of your audience if you keep saying the same thing or using the same word over and over again. For example, I'm looking at commission, and I want to find out what other words I can use that mean the same thing. To do that, come up here, click on the Review tab, go to the Proofing group, and there it is, thesaurus. You can see when I hover over it, it says, at a loss for words, let us suggest another way to say what you mean. All right. So with the cell selected of the word that I want to look up, go ahead and click on it. Opens up the task pane, thesaurus, and it gives us some options here. Let's see if we can find one that means the same thing. To earn a commission, a command, a directive. Okay, not finding it so far. A fee, a payment, maybe. In any case, when you find what you're looking for and you want to replace it with that word, with the word that's in your cell, then just go ahead and hover over it. You can click on the drop down arrow or you can right click on it gives you the same shortcut menu. You can insert it, well, inserts it over the word there, or let me go ahead and hit undo because I don't want to do that. Or you can right click on it and copy it and come over here, select a cell, right click on that and paste it. That works as well. Go ahead and close out of here. Next, let me scroll back. Let's do the smart lookup. So again, find a cell that contains a word in it and select it. And then come up here on the review tab in the insights group and do smart lookup brings up the Insight Task Pane, and you get the Explore option and the definition or defining that word. First of all, the Explorer actually defines the word, but it goes into it a little bit more in depth down below because it wants to explore in other areas besides the definition, like Explore Wikipedia, the Commission, 9-11, Web Search, Utah County Commission. Oh, there's a lot of different commissions, but if you just want to define it, go ahead and click on that to get a bit more detail than what you have on the Explorer up at the top. Here you can see it as a noun, and then just go ahead and scroll down as a verb. Cool. Now, if I close out of that, and I want to do it to a cell that contains more than a word, how's it going to handle it? Not very well, so just basically do it to cells that have a single word in it. And that also goes for the thesaurus, as well as the smart lookup. You can also right-click on the cell and go down to smart lookup. It brings up the task pane. And what is it looking for? REI. What's that? Is it looking for camping or gear or US? So if I select define, I can't find anything but back to explore. Found camping. And it looks like it's doing okay because it's got camping gear. So it's trying to do the best it can with everything in that cell. But it can't define it because well, there's too many words in that cell. So it's not as smart as I thought. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you subscribe to my YouTube channel, as soon as I upload a new video, you'll be notified instantly. And you can do that by coming over here and clicking on my face. You can also click here to support me. So for $2 a month, you can have access to over 2,700 training videos, all ad-free. And for a few bucks more, you can have access to my exercises, instructor notes, quizzes, certificate of completion, and a whole lot more.